Hello everybody and welcome back to Farm Simulator 2015 on Northwest Ohio. So last we left off we started this field and I said I was going to start working on some. Well I am a good chunk of the way done. So I wanted to refill the drill once. So hopefully we will finish this up. And I need to make another end on this. Because this is ridiculous. So this will take us a little bit to do. This, maybe 30 acres left. Probably more than that. Yeah, it's more than that. Probably about 50 left. get this end straightened out here so it's nice and straight that should do hopefully yeah the reason for that is when I was what well, you guys saw when I was cutting in I didn't do that right. I want to clean that all up so this is all straightened out. And then I'm going to probably maybe start over here and work my way so I start closest to the farm. And closest to the farm. I still got, what's well, the second video? I still got three videos recording. I think I got an idea on how to make it to where I actually have something to do. Might not be the most realistic thing to do, but it would help us. Some you might be able to figure it out by looking. Nope, not on there. It's time fast forward. I might just time forward to the next day. Or whenever. Give us some growth. I don't know. I might only plant one field corn. I mean, these beans are going to be a lot. And it's going to be a lot of beans here. And that stupid thing did it again. There we go. Yep, we'll probably be spraying tomorrow. Maybe spraying corn. Now we'll be putting, we put in hydrogen corn. I've been working on this field for, oh, an hour, maybe. 
it, believe it or not, it took quite a while to get. I'm just on the other side of the barns over there, if you see. And I went from over there, and it goes clear back behind the woods. It took quite a while, but I got it. This isn't going to take very long, considering it's only about three-quarter distance, maybe. I did add a stubble cultivator and sewing machine stuff in. If you see it on the bottom, control B. I'm not doing it right now because we don't have any thing to, like, that's for more or less if you want no-till. We have nothing to no-till. So we're just direct seeding it. Direct drilling. Oh, I'm tired. Thank God I don't have really morning band tomorrow to sleep in. Hmm. I don't know how rough a ride this will be in this 4440 Patriot. I don't think it'll be that rough. There, now it's all squared off. It shouldn't take all video to do, although it might, very well might. I just started playing this game called Egg Eek. It's kind of a stupid game, but time killer. I mean, I don't know if any of you've heard of it. My wheel is completely messed up. Feels like I'm spinning somewhat. Yep, our silos are going to be full with these beans. I mean, we're hopefully out of this harvest. I want to buy a new combine. I want to get, and I'll show you the combine I want. Right here. Pretty sure I want this one. Although... I might want this one. This one doesn't fold up, and this one does. So I don't know. We'll just have to see. This will be if we get bigger ground. Never going to use that in the melon tarp. So that's it. Then the header is right here. And no, we're not going to use this header. We're not using an 18 row header. We're going to use the 12 row. 12 is the max I'm going to go. Either 8 or 12 row. Actually, I don't know if we even have an 8 row. Just 8 row. I think it's just 4, 6, and 12. Yeah, there's no 8 row. That'd be nice if they had an 8 row header. If anybody can point me towards a decent 8 row header, please point me there because I want an 8 row header.
Actually, we might hire this guy. And I might get into this and take the Meridian back. Because we do not need it. And when I speed up time, it will leave. So I might as well just take it back. That better not leave pizza cuts at the end, because then I mean, I guess I can clean them up. I just want somebody else to do it, because I kind of got tired of drilling. Man, think about it, that's a lot of drilling to do. And now I have not found a sprayer trailer yet. Believe me, I've been looking. The only one I found is the Manac. I mean, it's a decent trailer, but I've used it before, and I, I don't know, I just don't want to use it anymore. I want the one like what Joe has. Lindbergh. Like what he has, a Prairie Hill modding trailer. I wish he'd release it. That'd be awesome. Only three mods. Only mods I want of his are his DB60. His. Um. DB120. I'd like to have his map, but. My computer won't run it anyways. Unless I get a holy crap. That was a wreck. This is full of seeds. So yeah. Don't know how it's going to work out. Don't know why I end up there. Eighty thousand. Well, I got over two hundred thousand. I don't know why it says sell. I, I mean not purchased. I rented it. Where do I have one? I know I'm just looking. Got this. That's water milk. This, it's not what you think. I've used it, and it's not what you think. Yeah, I don't really see anything else I could use. Right now, I know he's going to leave that strip. Of unplanted ground, but I can do that. that's just standard in game stuff. Oh, I just realized we got a lot of ground to spray, not too much for the 4440 Patriot, though. Oh, that's a wussy horn, I get a real semi horn. That'd be awesome to have Jake break coming into this. Next big thing we'll be doing is anhydrous. Spraying won't take long. Anhydrous is our next big thing. Got that cornfield to applicate and knife anhydrous on. And I'm going to be up on top of my semi. So, we'll go check on him, maybe. Actually, let's get our 4440 Patriot out. Work on it, you know. Work. I got the fake quotation marks up, you know. And, uh, and I just clipped through the thing. Let us park, put that there, because I want to put it back in the shed.
And I just demolished that wall. Maybe it helps if I actually look where I'm going. So I won't be needing this until fall. Primary tillage. I want to put that in there. Now what we're going to do with this is we're going to check all the tips. Shouldn't be plugged. I love the indoor sound on this. Only reason I'm doing this so I can back up and be. Somewhat. Wind up so I don't hit the building. I'll be out over the field but. Just checking all the tips on it, because we'll be using it. Okay, so these are massive 120 foot booms. So just one check on our. How's he doing? Not bad. Uh, right, so let's go check on the booms here. I like these flexible hoses. How they flex. What the? That control for the booms. And we got control over here. Sweet. So I could just, you know, like, open that door. Gotta go in the shop and grab the grease gun. Let's go over here. <laughs> I don't know why this is kind of stupid, but, you know, it's just for the realis realistic sake. I gotta find some grease certs on this. If there'd be any. I haven't really dealt with sprayers, so I don't know if it'd be in grease certs. I doubt Joe would have took all the time to model a grease cert. Maybe some greasing back here, maybe. Some grease in there. You know what? This is totally on the. Yeah, it's realistic, but it's totally stupid. <laughs> it really is totally stupid. Well, our Patriots already. I might fill up a spray. So next episode, we're ready to spray. We're doing that. I. Well, what's my time even at? 10 minute warning. 10 minutes remaining. When was that? Okay. I still got about 10 minutes left. Alright. Just wondering. I figured by now I'd be like, you know, way over the time. Right. We're going to spray our corn first. Corn needs sprayed like the first stage. Just going to hop out of that. This is going to take a lot of fill up. <sighs> Almost done.
Okay, we want to fold up our ladder. Oh, I don't know. There's our ladder. Is that really all it does? Hmm. Alright, so it's back up. Actually, we might, if we have room, put her in the shop. Since we're going to be spraying with it next. This is going to be too wide for too long. And we will continue with that next episode. Anyway, people. Yes, this has been a short episode. But there ain't really any crap going on whatsoever. So, I'm going to end the video here. And remember... Until next time, <laughs> keep on farming.